Well, hello and welcome once again, J76NY here, and it is episode number 45 of our Japanese playthrough on War on the Sea. Uh, last episode, we discovered a pretty major threat here in uh, this area. We have not one, but two groups of, uh, call them the Bogues and Battleships. Um, only one is showing up right now. I'm kind of wondering if they merged together. Uh, for some reason, they had, uh, I think one of them only had like four or five ships. Uh, so we are going to get our scout to redirect over here. Keep eyes on them. Um, I-11 with 12 torpedoes is moving in. We've got I-17. 17 torpedoes, she's moving in. Uh, if they come up this way, we can hit them with I-11 and then move in with the Congo battle group. I-17 can cover their approaches down here. Uh, over here we do have, uh, it says, uh, three ships, one DE and two submarines, possibly, so, uh, we're going to not use you to scout them out, but we will use this, no we won't. There we go, someone with some range. We'll use them to keep tabs on them and see what they are. Uh, my plan is once the Chokaku gets into range, we're going to launch an airstrike. Uh, hopefully we can eliminate that carrier because I don't want to deal with this, and I'm sure my pilots don't either. So let's uh, get the ball rolling and move in on the enemy. Whoops. Alright, we just kind of lost sight of them. They're moving in over there. Uh, right off the bat, our Jake has a encounter. Would be all of this out here. Hopefully that doesn't pull the, uh, the group in too, and I didn't really get a good chance to um, see how they were maneuvering, so... Uh, we do have three Jakes out in the area. Someone would have seen something by now, so let's get out of here. Okay, Yamato. Gotta remember we got a group out here we're trying to keep tabs on to. Which direction are they heading? It looks like they're heading south. Like due south, I believe. Yep. Um, Congo, uh, we're just going to have you patrol like this for now until we have a definitive idea of where they're going to be going. Uh, what can we get up for attack planes? Uh, three Mavises. We can launch our Zeros from here and send them in with... Uh, I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to launch our Zeros. Not going to worry about the uh, bombs on them. Have them come out here. All right, they are moving south, so... Shokaku, get those... Let's get those veils up. Um, go with this, make our, the carrier our, our primary target, um, escort those veils, there you go, Yamato battle group has an encounter, that would be a submarine, more than likely. Uh, we do have a scout up and about, so let's begin this. Uh, turn your radar on. There we go. 
see what we can see. See where those torpedoes are going to be coming from. This is definitely not the battle group I want to lose. There we go. I think that's, uh, oh, maybe not. Yep, there we go. There's the torpedoes right there. We are going to break. Start turning. Ashigara. Uh, let's break everybody, actually. I were to guess I'd say they'd be coming in on the Yamato, but we can uh, react accordingly. Let's get everyone up to full speed. We're going to turn you out a little bit. You are going to be heading right into the... Uh, right in there. I'm going to get you sped up. I'm going to keep you moving slow. Get the Takao moving. And we're going to slow you down and cut you across. Alright, let's see how the spread plays out here. Oh, they are heading right for our uh, light cruiser. So let's set your course like that. Make sure you're not going to be running into them. You can actually slow down a little bit. Same with the Yamato. Uh, see if we can get around them. That's going to be close. Wow, look at that. That was lucky. Okay, Takao. Slow you down. Have you come up out like this? Speed you up to get up into the engagement area. Just turn your sonar on. Sonar on. Alright, you can slow down now. Start going straight. I think I've slowed everyone down that could possibly be in danger, except maybe uh, this destroyer out here. So let's speed her up. Um, let's actually send you... Okay, slow down. Uh, Takao is not looking very good. Alright, so Takao needs to... Looks like if she manages to come to a stop, she'll be alright. Okay, so our... Destroyer. And get you up to speed. Have you come out? Oh. Actually, turn. Let's see if we can get you out of the way there. Okay, straighten out, you should be good. Alright, slow down. If we can see where uh, the sub is on the surface or not. Okay, you're heading up. I have you head up as well. There we go, we got something. So uh, just have everyone come to a stop. Less noise, I guess. Oh, 
hopefully they don't decide to launch a uh, second spread. I've never actually seen that happen except in someone else's playthrough. I don't think that was so much uh, two spreads as it was uh, two subs. The only time I've ever seen that. Pretty impressive. So we have tabs on you. Let's hit. Let's have you turn. Uh, you're fine doing what you're doing. Target. Target. At 150 feet. Let's speed things up a little bit. Alright, this is going to be our uh, primary attack vessel here. 36 depth charges. Let's go with uh, 5 on a 7 second sp spread. Uh, we did lose them, but that's alright. It's because we're going pretty fast here. Once we slow down, we'll be able to pick them up again. But we'll do that. We'll slow you down as well. And then we'll leave you as is for the time being. Bring you up to about 14 knots. I'll pick them up again. Go oh, active. There we go. Uh, she's going six knots. Let's pick the speed up a little bit. I ordered you to slow down. Doesn't seem to want to do it though. There we go. Have you turn up like this. Sene may come in contact with her first at this rate. Uh, there you slow down. There go our brave destroyers off to chase the threat. Alright, we're coming up on her pretty quick. Okay. Get you moving a little bit, but not much. Let's see, where are you? You come up. Turn your sonar on. I can speed up a little bit, I guess. I think we're lined up pretty good. Right. Try and cut in front of her. Drop her speed down to 14. So we get out in front of her. Slow speed to match. Okay, fire your depth charges. Let's see how we how we're doing here. Been pretty good. Hi, did you I don't think there's going to be a 
and he's surviving this. Those charges look really good. This one down right here is uh, kind of in the wrong spot, but that's all right. Right there we are right there let's uh reverse a little bit slow down he's not moving at all so she is losing losing depth another spread will do it from her probably drop down uh let's go with three Okay. All right, she's blowing her ballast. Let's um, move. Get out of her way. I forgot to fire. There we go. Let's see if we can get her before she broaches. All right, have you pick up the speed and turn that way? What are we doing here? There we go. All right, depth charges are out. And she's coming up. Really thought that other spread would have, uh... There we go. All right. Good deal. One more sub down. More command point gained. Alright. Back to the business at hand. This carrier here. I think we lost this guy. Uh, that'd be my guess. I'm with how fast they moved out of the area. So we're gonna get our uh, get our planes into position. For a uh, strike. They do have a pretty solid uh, combat air patrol, so We can take out the uh, carrier. We've got Congo and Yamato that can move in. All right, there we go. Vales are in position with their escort. Um, I guess as we probably pulled our sub into the. Oh no, no, we didn't. All right. Let's just start right away and see what we can see. There they are. And there is the battleship. There is the... Oh, shit. Seriously? Zeros. Zeros are moving into attack. Unfortunately, the... Uh, well, it's not a... Bad combat or patrol, I guess. Let's target you. Target you. Target you. Target you. Um, we've got one, two, three, four, four groups left. So let's, uh, I want to try something here. I had a recommendation in the uh, comment section to break them all off and individually send them, send them in on the attack. So let's, uh, let's do that. See how that works. Okay. Let's have you attack. Break. Okay, you can move in on the attack. Target. Our zeros are kind of far out there. 
So we are going to go through and select all of them. Now there's only, at least right now, there's only uh, four of them, so... Okay, you attack number one. You attack number three. And you attack number two. We'll leave the others to do what they what they desire. In case they uh, show up with more. Alright. Alright, so they are a little more prepared than what I originally thought. Two, two, three. I hope some of these guys get through this. Attack. Attack. Oh, man. This is going to be ugly. Now, these guys aren't on target yet. I have you target... Have you target the Cleveland as well? And then the three of you. We're just going to send them all in on the attack in their groups. See how we do. I probably should have held some of them off until we saw what the uh, the damages to the carrier were. Ah, damn, they're just getting shredded again. Alright, down they go. It's a lot of AA. They're gonna have to come through. Not even sure any of them got their bombs off. Yep, there's a bomb coming down. Missed. What are my zeros doing way out there? Everything missed. And we got hits on the Cleveland. Look at all those veils. They're all done. Didn't get one hit on the uh, carrier. I do know how to get my pilots killed, that's for sure. Alright, so this cruiser took some good hits. Uh, this... Cruiser took some good hits. I don't think the carrier got anything whatsoever, so... Okay, zeros. Too little, too late, my friends. Too little, too late. But we're gonna go in anyway, just because... Well, you know, spite. them all up, just so I can turn that off. Alright, break. How many veils do we still have? We got one, two, three, two, three, four, five, six, seven veils. Warm up. And leave. I don't know why it keeps... Alright. No, no. Alright, well, how are our... Where are you going?
kind of wondering if any of these guys are actually attacking these enemy planes. Watch the uh, dog fight. Shooting at my own guy. Yeah, I am. All right, so we have anyone left? Yep. There's the. Uh, I think that's the last two of them out there. Got a few of them left still. There we go, there's our ace for the day. Anyone else? This formation's a mess. Let's check the damages on them. Minor. That was well worth the attack and the sacrifice. Alright, well, let's get the hell out of here. So despite the fact that we had a pretty impressive uh, cap, we didn't do jack for damage. Might have spooked them, though. Maybe they'll start running north now. That would be helpful. Really don't want to try and take this group on. Oh, they're not running north. They're running south. Alright, out you go. Out you go. Yep. They're running away. Kaku's ready to launch. That's fine. You can return to base. Zeros return to base as well. Kind of looks like we're catching up to him a little bit. Oh. Got this encounter here with this Jake. Hi, Savo. That's not Savo. Not even close. Whoops. Ha! Ah. Alright, well, whatever. Away we go. Let's try and get our subs into position. I don't think it's going to happen. But, you know. I think we're uh, being led astray for a reason. All right, let's have you patrol like this. Have you set up a patrol pattern like this? <clears throat> Gonna give them a little bit to uh, get back down in here, and then I'm gonna pull them back. Get our uh, other submarine patrol and their approaches to Guadalcanal over here. Put them back on station in a second. Uh, we do have our command points, so what do we have in the dockyard? Our carrier is ready to come back out. So let's go grab, uh, 
wonder if there's anything else we could pull for uh, carriers that's a little more powerful than the uh, escort carrier there. 110, 80. Do we have 58? Nah, it's not going to work. EO. What do we have for planes? That's not bad. For 80. 60. Eh. This will go with the uh, CVL. Alright, Zuiho. 15 zeros, 6 veils, 9 torpedo bombers. 12 torpedo bombers. Osho. Not much. Alright, we're gonna go with the Zu the Zuiho. Okay. Zuiho, you are going to come down here. Hang on. Medium bombers? Oh. Huh. How many? Twelve? Jake medium bombers? Tose? Oh, it's tempting. Tempting. Hmm. I think I'm actually going to throw a couple more escorts in with this. I don't think we have any uh, <clears throat> much in the way of... There we go, Nagaras for 14. Oh. Alright. Nagara. So we've got four. That's fine. Okay, let's merge you. Man, that, was, that air attack was uh, not that good. I should have just sent everybody right, away, right against the uh, against the carrier. Shouldn't have tried to get fancy with it. All right, so they're gonna go down, meet up, and then head back down. Um, just gonna have to replenish our air air group. And we still have the. Uh, 17 vales and 18 cades, that's not too bad. Um, it's almost 3 o'clock. We could potentially make another strike on them. As long as it was escorted. So we're going to launch our zeros. Send them out like that. It's time a little bit. We're going to launch our 17 horse down to you. Oh, they're outside of range now? Alright, well, escort them as far as they can make it. So we'll get them down there. They're going to run out of range before they get there. So I think uh, once this day falls tonight, we're going to be pulling our forces and re-patrolling where we were until the next, uh, until the next group shows up. And like I was saying, here we go. Ten ships. So, I-26, uh, what's your, oh, you know, I mean, range left, all right. Well, these guys clearly don't want anything to do with uh, engaging us right now, so we are going to be bringing a uh, change of plans. We'll bring you up into here. 
I-26, we're going to have you patrol right here, like this. I-17, I'm going to bring you around in case they come around the south side of these islands here. Put you in a patrol pattern like that. I-25, we're going to hold her back. Uh, but we are going to move in with the Congo group. Put them smack dab in the middle there. Uh, we are going to get a surface engagement out of this. At some point, we are going to get a surface engagement. And it's going to be spectacular. Because my air engagements have just been falling flat. And I take personal responsibility for that, as any good commander should. So let's see what we have here. Our next threat. There they are out there. Let's take a look through the binoculars, see what we can see. We have one carrier, one battleship. Three supply ships, one heavy cruiser. And a couple of light cruisers. Or maybe not. More destroyers than anything else. So that's the, uh, oops. That is what we are up against now. Oh, hello. Well. Let's get out of here. Turn! Turn! Wow, man, just dodge them all. Yeah, they're not gonna let us go easy. Turn, turn, turn! No, don't attack. Turn! Dive! Turn again! Look at all those planes coming after our scout. Turning in. Change altitude. And turn. Yep. Caught one right in the face. Well. One, two, three destroyers. One, two, three uh, cargo ships. A Bogue and a uh, It's like a New Mexico. So that being uh, five o'clock at night is going to be what we're going to be dealing with tomorrow when the sun comes up. Or maybe sooner. You never know. This may turn into a night engagement, which, uh, well, it may very well turn into a night engagement. We can get up there in time. Okay, you're coming down. You're coming up. So are you? really think they're just going to come up this way. Uh, so to that end, I'm going to redirect you to patrol right here. Like that. I'm going to keep you close in, like I said. Uh, bring you down to the south, bring you up to the north. Bring our air cover a little closer. Uh, this group is moving in to uh, join their escorts. Supply convoy is moving up to grab some more supplies. Four thousand troops. Thirty-two thousand supplies. I think. Uh, we're more than set on fuel, so we're going to be grabbing supplies and engineering. 
And we're going to send them down with the next convoy. As we close out the 27th of September, 1942, day 51 of Operation Mo. Um, hope you guys have been enjoying the series so far. This is easily, hands down, my favorite game that I'm playing right now. I do have a bunch of different stuff going on. And there's other games that I'm uh, probably going to be bringing to the channel fairly soon. Um, but this one is what I've sunk the most hours into, and I love it. So, like I said, I hope you guys are enjoying the series. And we will see you for the next episode. If you like the episode, hit the like button. Come along with us. The more the merrier. Hit the subscribe. Leave your thoughts, tips, and advice in the comments below, and we will see you for the next episode of Operation Mo, J76NY. Saying thank you very much for watching, and have yourself a very, very good day.